Hi, this is Dave Brown from Stair. We're going to show you how to set up your HEM1 special. At this point, remove the paper over the stickers on the side of the machine. Remove the screen protector now and make sure the glass is secure and hasn't fallen out during moving. Now you can open up the box. Inside the box you should have a lens inside of a white box, the tablet, the tablet holder, and a bag. Inside the bag you have a user's manual, an M1 user's guide, the warranty card, the certs from the factory, the certs that we do here at Kinemetric, the plug cable, and the plugs to put in the hole in the side of the machine for the lifting bars, screen clips, and the knob that goes on the Y-axis. To install the knob, you'll need a two and a half millimeter Allen wrench to remove the drive wheel off the front of the machine and a three millimeter Allen wrench to install the knob onto the drive wheel. Now you can see right above the stage there's two decals. They tell you to remove the locking straps and the transport straps. Go over to the left hand side underneath the back edge of the stage there is a L bracket with two screws in it. Loosen those two screws. Those are transport straps and then go to the front and remove the six millimeter nut that's in there using a five millimeter wrench. Undo that nut so that you have your stage travel. You can move the stage back and forth and up and down and forwards and backwards of focus. Make sure everything is functioning. From that point, you'll see that there is a DRO bracket mount. Take those four screws out. Mount your DRO bracket. Once you get your DRO bracket mounted, you can mount the base unit to the DRO bracket. Then you can mount the DRO mount itself. It is a locking unit. It snaps if you rotate the lock right or left. It'll unlock it, mount it on the machine, and you can lock the unit inside of it. The plug is only there for charging the tablet. It is not there for connection to the unit itself. That's all done through Bluetooth. Go ahead and plug in the plug in the back of the machine. Turn the system on. When you turn the power on, you should see the screen on your tablet come up. Then what we can do from that point, check and make sure everything's working. Thank you for watching. Make sure you watch our next video on how to do a calibration check.